Welcome to episode number 10 of his Dallas Stars NHL 21 franchise series. And today, we're playing my Dallas Stars franchise series, obviously. Round 2, Game 4 against the Blues in St. Louis. And the Stars are at 3 games to none. So they're a 1 win away from sweeping the Blues. Moving on to the Western Conference Final to play the Edmonton Oilers or the Winnipeg Jets. And in that series right now, the Oilers lead the Jets 2 games to 1. And Pavelski leads our team in the with points during the playoffs, seven innings played, six goals, ten assists, sixteen points. Uh, let's look at the final score: game two and three. Game one. Well, I was lost episode. If you haven't seen any episodes in the, any of the episodes in the series. There's a playlist for the series. If you haven't seen it yet, be nice and shine the upper corner right up here. As game one, we beat the Blues seven series. You saw that in the last episode. And we beat the Blues in game two seven five. And then we beat the Blues in game three five two. So the final scores were seven nothing in game one, seven five in game two. And 5-2 in game three. So, the Blues, yeah, I mean, we've in three games, we've scored uh, four, 19 goals, and they have scored seven. So, we're out scoring them 19-7, and obviously we have three wins, and we are one win away from sweeping the Blues and moving on to the Western Conference Final of play, like I said, the Oilers or the Jets. And the Oilers lead the Jets two games to one in their series, and then the two, uh, Center round series is in the Eastern Conference. It's the Rangers and the Bruins. Rangers lead the Bruins two games to one. And then it's the Maple Leafs and the Sabres. And the Sabres lead the Maple Leafs two games to one. And yeah, now it's the end of the game. It's in St. Louis because we have home ice advantage. We will for every series unless, I believe, yeah, are the Lightning out? Oh, hold on. I want to see. Is the, Are the Lightning out? Because then there was only one team that was better than us. Oh, it's the May the May boys are the team that's better. The Lightning, yeah, they're out. Had 103 points. We had 112. May boys had 113. So, and the points have 112, which they're out already. So, I mean, if we played them, we would we had the we have a tie we have a tiebreaker because obviously we're set in there third. So we have only, we would have almost advantage. We would throughout the what the first three rounds if we did that far. Which are one one away from the Western Diamonds final, which is the third round. And then we saw and then if we not somehow, but if we play the main blitz in the Stanley Cup final, then they will have home ice advantage because they had one more point than us. As yeah. They had we had hundred and twelve points, they had hundred and thirteen. So they won the President's trophy by one point. One point still one point. And right now, like I said, what they're down yeah, they're down two games on over Buffalo. Now let's get in our game. As the stars, like I said, are one game away from sweeping the blues or and the Stars are one win away from sweeping the Blues and moving on to the Western Conference Final. It's the end of the game right now. To enter Press Center in St. Louis, where I was born. I actually was born in St. Louis. I, I was. I don't remember being in the yards, but I was in the yards because there, well, my parents say I, said I was, and there's pictures at, somewhere, I think. So, um, do you do any throwbacks? That's say, Tyler Sandin for us. Looks like he's throwing a playoff beard, and I'm not sure that is for that. That might be Tara Sandin, maybe. I don't know. Um, I don't know. I'm thinking maybe maybe it reverse retros. I don't I don't I think for some of the episodes in, of render season games I think one day I didn't against the Senators I wore the, our alternates which are these which I'm not gonna wear on the at home or on the road but maybe I wear our NHL reverse retro because it's, they're white. Yeah, why not? Let's wear our NHL uh, reverse retro. I do like them. Um, and then maybe they wear their all, what's their alternate, uh, that would be, that's really blue. Did I do this? I mean, it's not like, it, it, it's, yeah, why not? We're wearing, our, the Stars are wearing their NHL reverse retros, and the Blues are wearing their alternate uniforms, so, yeah, why not? Uh, style church, no line, four minutes, still semi-pro, which is the second easiest difficulty here in NHL 21, and the on-ice trainer is be dinner, and by the way, yes, this is still NHL 21, I'm gonna probably, I'm gonna ask that, for NHL 22 for Christmas, which is what, what? December 25th, obviously, and it, right now it's November 6th, so Christmas is less than two months away. I think it's what, now less than 50 days away, I believe. Now let's end the game right now. Let's watch the premonition, Jane Sabalski, round two, game four.
We're seven now in the playoffs. They're four and six. Their goaltender is Jordan Bennington. He's four sits now in the playoffs with a 3.37 goals against average. No shutouts. And our goaltender is Ben Bishop. He's 7 0 0 with a 1.97 goals against average. And I think like three shutouts instead or something. It was one, one of those three shutouts was a well in game one of the series. Here we go. Sayden versus O'Reilly on the faceoff. And Sayden wins it. Down the back pass by Klimberg. Shaw just missed the net. I just thought she missed the net. Here we go. I do like these uniforms. For both teams. Shaw turned aside. By Bennington, stolen away by Satan, turns the spot, score! What a setup by Satan in the pen! And the captain delivers as he scores a minute, 12 seconds into the hockey game, and the Stars strike first in game four. A turnover, and then a pass from the goal line into the, to the, a cross crease pass from the goal line in the far corner from Satan to the slot for Benning. Dits it in. Assisted by Satan. And now Satan loses his face off. Here comes St. Louis up ahead to David Perron. To the slot. O'Reilly just got nailed. Their captain is not Petrangelo because he's on Vegas. I believe their captain is O'Reilly. Here we go. Here's shot by Satan. It's blocked by someone. Here's Petrangelo. I'm trying to hit the bend, but not blocked. Here comes St. Louis. Three minutes into the game four. Here they come and got bumped off the punt. Here's Haston and raised him out the other way. And he lost the putt to Pareto. Pareto's in the corner. Up ahead to Perron. He's at the red line. Now he's in the... By the dot. Here's Pareto. Up ahead. O'Reilly. And he just got bumped to Dan. Here's Tarasenko, though. And here's Pareto. To the... In the circle. Shot. Stopped by Bishop. No rebound. 15-0-1. They're down in the first. Justin Fault. Two goals. Nine assists. 11 points. Leads the team. in points here in the playoffs. Like I said, Justin Fault. Who is a defenseman? Now, uh, Pavelski loses the faceoff back to Fault. Steen below the goal line. Here's uh, Shen. Here's Fault. Lost the punt to Rupe Hintz. Hintz raised him out the other way. Doesn't really have anyone coming close. Uh, Hintz hits its own rebound. Uh, it's kicked out of there. Back to Ethan Bear, who has two goals here in the playoffs in seven games after he had, didn't have any in like 10 games or 20. And then one of his first goal. Uh, as a star in a star's uniform in the regular season or the postseason was I believe in name one of the series. He also had a goal in one of the other games. And that is uh is there a fight? There is a fight. It's Ethan Bayer and Braden Shen. Someone got hit hard. I'm not sure what happened. I didn't really want to do this, but here we go. Looks like Shen's winning at the time. I'm not sure if Shen's a defenseman, but Ethan Bayer's a defenseman. Now in B free agency, the last team was the Oilers, which meant play in the West Final. And Shen won. Hopefully the Bears not hurt. Uh, they did up slowly. Up and, but someone else hurt, but someone got hit hard. A uh, Blues player got hit hard, and then the Blues. Uh, I don't think there's any. In, Bear was slowly did up, but then he's fine. Face off is in, in the left circle of our zone. Uh, 12 minutes to go in the period. Here's Stan Diddle! And then it stopped. Here's Steven Johnson. I know he's retired in real life, but remember, NHL 21. Here's Robertson. I hit hard. Following up is Dickinson, though. Across Kamano! Denied by Bennington. He passes out the fault. Bain passed behind the net to Standella. Here's Stanford, or Stafford, or is it Stanford? Here we go. Oh, here's Thomas. Lost the putt. Here we go. It stays. St now Stafford now has it. 9.45. They're down the period. one nothing. Uh, Dallas, they lead the game one up and they lead the series three up and here we go, got a run and Thomas Bozan turned the side of my bishop and passed to the center up and Nick Kamano. Here we go, Robertson to his right, Kamano slammed on the brakes, lost the putt, center has it though to the slot, Robertson lost the putt, I believe that was Robertson. 7.50 they go in the period, here we go, and of course, shot by Thomas, stopped by Bishop, 7.27 they go here in the first, still one up in Dallas. Out there for the it's Perron, O'Reilly, and Tarasenko for forward. They're not sure about the defenseman. Here we go. And at the Haston in. Up ahead to Kamano. Up ahead to Taliano is no longer on the team. But it's NHL 21. Here we go. Shot by Bunsen. He scores. Right at Bunsa. On the center by Taliano. And the Stars double their lead. Sending all the playoffs for Bunsa. 13-11 into the first period. 2 up in Dallas here in game four. Good set up by Taliano. Assisted by... Well, Taliano and Tomo, I believe. 
That's FCC, FCC line. Fonsa, Taliano, and Tomo, assisted by Taliano and Tomo. Fonsa hits the goal. Here's Perron. Up at, or bat the crude. Lost the putt to Tomo. Here's Fonsa, who just scored. And Hastings lost the putt. Now the Tanner Saint is back! And the shot is blocked by Klimberg. Here's Taliano now. Blue right by Pareto. Passes it over to Tomo. He scores! Three and answer for Dallas to, lead, to start the game. Three up in Dallas. It's Como. Sending all the playoffs for him. 14.59 in the first. Three up in Dallas. So he scored two goals in what, like, less than two minutes. And the start lead 3 0 here in game. I was late on that. Stadium loses the face off. Assisted by Talion and Fonsa. So last two goals were assisted, um, well, because of the FCC line, which is our fourth line, which is the Fonsa. Fonsa, Taliano, and Tomo, which in real life they don't have Taliano, but they do still have Fonsa and Tomo, but obviously they're on a different line. But now we have Michael Raffle, Luke Lundenen, some other people. Here's Radulov, who we still have along with Satan and Ben and some other players like Pavelski, Nurianov, and his shot by Radulov! Turn the sign, it's loose. Blues have it, 3.30 to go in the first period, 3 0 in Dallas. There's Trude, a bad Perron, onside at the line, and Ben just slammed him hard. And now Tarasino has it to the slot. Here's O'Reilly blocked by Hastinen. A bad to Radulov, two minutes remaining. Here in period number one, shot by Satan to not go. It's loose in the paint, covered by Ben with a minute 25 remaining. And we lose the face off. I believe that was Sunquist or something like that. Here's Clifford. Under a minute, a minute to play here in the first period. He got hit hard. Pavelski nailed the other die. That was me. Here's Durnov up the bear. And that's intercepted. Ten seconds to play. Uh, Blue Blitten for a buzzer beer. What a hit. Fold has one last chance. And that's rolls in on Bishop. Passes out to Pavelski. He sends it down the ice. And the horn sounds. And that's the end of the first period. Three up in Dallas after one period of play here in game four. We outshot them. There's only seven sets on the shots. But we outscored them 3 0. We outshot them seven sets. So we scored three goals in seven shots. We're out hitting them 7 3. Time attack. We have about, what, 10 seconds more. 246 to 237. Two, two Passing 80 86% 80 for us, 96% for them. So 86% is usually more than. 86% is usually more, mine's usually like 70, but I'll take 86%. Obviously, face off, sits three, so sits three in favor of St. Louis. Penalty minutes just five each because of that pen, the five minute major for fighting on Bear and what, Shen, and then no power plays, no pe power play minutes, and no short handed goals. As obviously, Ben stored, and then what, Foss is stored, and then Tomo stored. Let's well, in the center period here in game four. The Stars up 3 0. They're up, they're up in the game, they lead the game 3 0, and they lead the series 3 0. And uh, Sainan wins a draw. Not, here's Ben. Lost the putt. Spooped around. Or spun around. Not spooped around. Uh, here we go. Here's Perron. 3 up in Dallas. Fans on their feet. That's an offside. No, it's not offside. I thought it was. Ben picks it up. Down around. Sainan to his right. Uh, ben will shoot it. It did save. But he just did on rebound. Back towards the slump. I believe it hit the goalie. Radjoff. Sainan lost the putt. Hit down low. Ben below the goal line. Kicked it out there to Sainan. Shot turned aside and held by Benningham, 1720 remaining. And when the draw, one timer by Randulov was hit hard or shot hard, but stopped by the glove of Bennington. Here was Rand or that was Gurionov, I believe, not Randulov, who took that one timer and did the shot right there. Bennington passes it out. And what a hit right in front of the right, right in front of Ray Ferraro. So he's r between the benches right down there. Here's Pavelski. Here's Hintz. Here we go. And that got intercepted by Sneen. Here's Stafford. Five minutes into the center period. Three up in Dallas. And got around the dive. Lost the putt. Picked up by Hasten and but sent it to nowhere. It's on net, so no Hasten. And Vincent came way out. Whoa! I just fell over my own dive. And here's. Oh, sorry about that. That 
That was awkward. Uh, so the putt was. Uh, uh, I'll spin that in a second, but either way, we have the putt now. Pavelski got nailed. So, what happened there? Just to clarify, what the. I've been saying it in a few of my vi few of my videos recently. This is an old TV, so it's the HDMI port. Um, it's old because the TV's old, and that's the p the the. I don't know what. Well. The feed, you could say, went out, so the game kept playing, that's why when it came back after, what, like, five seconds, the putt was in the, bo uh, um, up against the boards, because the game, is you, the PS4 was still on, and the game was still happening, it just, because the, the feed, or the screen turned off for, like, five seconds, because, like I said, the HTML port's old, but the TV's old, so, sorry about that, but that's not, that's not, and then, so, yeah, sorry about that. Bob said it's gonna do that, so hopefully we'll get a new TV soon. My dad said we're gonna get a new one soon, but I don't know when that soon's gonna be. Top 10 hits, you see O'Reilly, O'Reilly, and Brayden Shen, they're 5th and 7th. O'Reilly's 5th, Shen's 7th. And Shen is not a defenseman, he's a center. He's in the face off a dense Jason Dickinson. And we won the draw. We only have, remember, 12 shots because it's a, Baines only had 9 saves and a slot. I missed everyone. Here's Stanford, or Stanford, I think. You know, 12 minutes over, and the second got hit hard, lost his stick, and he and now it's turned over. Here's Snead on a bridge. Benny or um, Bishop said no, and the stick is in the by the boards in the start zone. That almost was a goal right there. Then the slot intercepted. Here's Blay. Here we go, halfway through the hockey game. We're halfway through the game four, three up in Dallas. Is there? They're up three nothing in the day and the series. Here's Ben and he not bumped out the butt, but he still has it. Mini breaked away, but Ben not bumped off again. Now Blaze had in the corner. Nine minutes to go in the period. St. Louis does get the putt out of that strum. Still three nothing Dallas though. Eight thirty remaining. And here we know there's Clifford. Clifford not blown or bulldozed by Ben, and now it's a stick and goes in the zone. And picked up by Ben. Beast Ben. I hit the side of the net. And Bertuzzo. And now I was up at the Perron. Here's Gunnarsson. Bertuzzi. Or Bertuzzo. Here we go. What a hit by Ben Perron. Point blank range stop by Bishop. And he passes the center on Ben, but who lost the putt. Now Gunnarsson has it. Up at the play. Here we go. Here's O'Reilly. That tripped up. And the Blues are going on the power play. 542 to go in the center period. The Blues, who are down 3 nothing are going up. On the power play. First power play for the Blues or their team in this hockey game. And I'm not sure who took the penalty, but it was us. I'm not sure what player that was. We lose the phase off. Here's Stamper. Shot blocked. Picked up by Setra and sent down to down the length of the ice to the other goal line. It was right by the goalie. And the Stars out of that did the punt. Back to Orfina Dickinson. Still has it. Blocker save. And send, send it all the way back. Till the penalty time. Bishop should play all he can. Can't play it in that forbidden zone. What a hit! Passes up the Clemmer Cedro does, and he sends it down the ice. 30 seconds into the power play. And that is. A penalty? Okay, it was like a penalty on them, so it'll be 4 on 4. I'm not sure what the. Charge in. I'll tell the replay. Oh! What a hit! You can't hit more than three steps and hit a guy. So is that Stanford, or Stafford, or, or I think Stanford. Uh. Oh, so it's two, four on four for a minute and 26 seconds. Here we go, we lose the face off. So four on four for another minute and 20 seconds. Five minutes to go in the period. And then we'll have a power play for like, what, like 30 seconds. Here we go, here's Ben. More space to move because there's less players. Two less players, or two less players. What a hit, but that's a penalty on Ben. And now Shen's in a fight, Ben. What is happening at this point? So there's a penalty on Ben for boarding. I don't know if that was boarding because it looked like if his if his bat is towards the player and his face is up against the board, that's boarding. But I don't think he, I thought he was parallel to the boards. Here we go. And uh, Shannon Dan who fought Ethan Bear Mount in the first, and Ben who's the star captain will lose. Well, they both go down to the ice, but Shen wins. Hopefully Ben's not hurt, but Ben's not in the penalty box for fighting and the boarding penalty. And the Blues will have a four on three power play. That's Borden? He's ejected? Crap. So now we're not. No, no, he scored the first goal bat in the first. Yeah, he's, he's gone. Are they both gone? 
Whoa! I hear that's Ben to uh, uh, argue, and Ben is gone! Game is conduct, and he had a boarding penalty too! So we have the board and penalty, the five minute major for fighting, and a game misconduct. So now it's a four on three power play for St. Louis for I'm not sure how many minutes. And that is clear. Now Bear might have a break here. He's lumbering his way in, and he scores! Ethan Bear, a short handed goal! With a four on three short handed goal, and the Stars have a four nothing lead. It's third of the playoffs. And I got a few free agencies. Last team was the Oilers. He played like 20 games or maybe more in the regular season. Had no goals, and now he has three goals in, well, seven, about what, just over seven and a half games. Two of them, I believe, was, I believe all three have been in the series, I think. Or if not, two, at least two have. So now it's still four on three power play for St. Louis. There goes Bennington. This is just chaos with all the penalties. Ben's ejected. I'm not sure who the backup is. I think it's 32. I think it said his name, but I didn't see it. Here we go. So, still four on three. We have Fonsa, Bear, and Lindell out there, I believe. And we win the face off. Bear didn't get all the way down. Here we go. And here we go. Here's Perron. Shot stopped by Bishop. And he covers 47 seconds to go on their four on three power play. And then after that, I'm not sure what happened. So, all I know is that four on three for 47 more seconds. And I'm not sure what happens after that. Face off's 8 8. Now, 9 in favor of us. Clear by Lindell. But 40 seconds to go here on this four on three. Hey! Yeah, it's a penalty! Penalty! He played it in the Forbidden Zone! Now it's three on three! Oh, what is happening? You don't want to see that every day like that. It didn't happen in the Real Life Stars game. It did in the Stars' last game in real life. And now there's three guys in the penalty box. And it's three on three like it is in overtime, which you, like, you never see unless it's set for overtime. So it's three on three for 40 seconds. Because obviously it's a delayed game penalty because the goalie played it in the Forbidden Zone. Here's O'Reilly, so it's three on three, light in overtime. And here's Hayston, who got the putt. And ne you never see this except for overtime in real life, really. And you see it here. I'm not sure what happens after this. But it's three on three right now. It's not by Dills or whatever. Then it's just Terrace saying, up at the Pareto. I'm not sure who's out there for us. Ten seconds ago here in this three on three portion. I'm not sure what ha who has the power play after this, because there's so many guys in the bots. And we go, and shot turns uh, blocks, so and now we have a four on three power play for half a minute. Shot turned aside by the goalie. I'm not sure what happens after this. I'm not sure how many people are still in the box. I know Ben's ejected, and I know we're still a four on three. Here we go, four on three power play for us for 20 more seconds. Ten, let's score! Shot turned aside by the goalie, and he covers this one. 3:24 to go in the period. 16 seconds to go here on our four on three power play. I'm not sure who's after this. Or what I mean is, I'm not sure what happens after this. Center period shots 11-3 in favor of us. Here's Lindell's shot. Turn aside. Rima, oh, what a save. Is in the 9, Pavel C. 3-20 on the period. 12 seconds to now on the Stars 4 on 3 power play. Uh, there's Pavel C. Looks like Raj off. I'm not sure who our defenseman is. Here we go. We lose the face off. Here's Bertuzzi. And he's just trying to kill a few seconds before he dumps it down. And that's a penalty on Pavelski. That was my bad. So now it's three on three at him for five seconds. This is just... This is penalty chaos. Three on three for five seconds. And, and I believe the Blues will have a power play after this. I'm not sure 100%. But three on three for five seconds. We win the draw. And here's Radulov. So now it's a power play. Four on three power play for a minute and 50 seconds for St. Louis. Shot turned aside. And I'm not sure. There's so many penalties. It's just... I have no idea. Here we go, there's Crude, down low, Fault, and stop by Bishop. 2.52 to go in the period, minute 39 to go in the 4 on 3 power play. I'm not sure what has happened. There's so many penalties. I mean, there was a fight for on Ben between Shen, Ben got a board and penalty, then a 5 minute major fight, in, and then a Dame misconduct. So we don't have our captain for us to the Dame. So the captain's going to be fir first shake hands here tonight if we win, which we're still up 4 nothing. 2.40 to go in the period, despite all this, these penalties and Everything that's happened, stopped by Bishop again. Send in a vacant corner. Here's John Spots, who scored in this game. Stopped by the goalie. This time, he's not playing in the Forbidden Zone. And I kind of bumped him right there. Here we go. Still have seven seconds to go in the power play. Now, actually, no. One guy not released. It was a St. Louis player. So now they're a five on three. So now it's five on three for one minute. So one die for St. Louis. Not out of the penalty box. I'm not sure who, but now it's. Goes from 4 on 3 to 5 on 3 for 50 more seconds. Here's Sekera. And now it's in the corner. Stanford got killed. 
And now, oh, oh, what is happening? Eventually, we did it out. Four sentences to on this power play. They probably have five on three power play. They probably have five on four after so I'm not exactly sure. Stafford did save. Somehow, he summons. Neither team has scored during this penalty mania. Well, I guess there was that shorthanded goal, but neither team has scored a power play goal. Despite there's been like thousands of opportunities and thousands of penalties in the last like 10 minutes. Shot by O'Reilly right into the chest of Bishop. Passes to Lundell, who turned it over. O'Reilly got put chest by Lundell. And now it's cleared by Ethan Bear. Ten seconds to go on the five on three. Here's Dial. So time at four, shots at twenty one fourteen favor us. The last clip and didn't miss anything. Time attack they have about we have about a minute more. Uh face house twelve ten in favor of us. Twenty not twenty nine penalties. Twenty nine penalty minutes. But why do why do they only have two power plays if that so it's penalty minutes twenty nine to fourteen in favor of us, no joke. Power plays zero for one is or so we they have they've had out of the twenty nine penalty minutes only two minutes and forty seconds of power play time. We've had twenty nine seconds. We're zero for one on the power play. They're zero for two. But if we had twenty nine penalty minutes, I know there was a five minute major fight at two. So that was at least ten minutes. And I said, oh yeah, I've, the game misconduct. So I, the game. So I, there was a two minute, the two uh, major five minute major fight. So that's ten minutes plus the game misconduct, which is ten. At least I here ten minutes too. So that'd be twenty minutes. Now how did it nine? I don't, I don't know. I'm super confused. All I know is that it's still 5 3 or 5 more seconds. What a hit! There, it's a hit fest, too. 5 and 3 is over. No, it's a, and now down low is turned aside by Bishop. Now it's 5 on 4 for St. Louis for a minute and 27 seconds. So that will roll over into the third period by like 17 seconds if the Blues don't score. And then that's 70 seconds. Still 4 off in Dallas, though, as we're killing off every penalty possible. They're over 3 on the power play of St. Louis. is 7 shots. They're getting shots. They just can't deal with it across the line. Here we go. Matt, last minute point in the period. Times are on slower than normal because of all these penalties. That's why it's taken like forever to do the last like five minutes of this period. Here we go. And I, not from behind. Pavelski will clear it out, but Terrasano cuts it off, so it went all the way down the ice. 45 minutes to do in the period. Pe pen power play will resume start the third period. If they don't score here, shot turned aside. Bishop's been sharp. 39 seconds to go in the period, 56 seconds to go in the Blues power play. Bishop has 16 saves and I want 16 shots, and that is not cleared by Fox to turn over. Thomas denied by Bishop, and he covers it now with 32.9 to go. And we lose a face off Terrasanto does not I don't know if that's the score for some reason, but it's not by Bishop and you and he won't play in the provision this time. And he hits it around the board. Almost got cut off. Is that a penalty? Yes it is. And it's now five on three. So there's so many penalties. That wasn't my fault though. So now it's five on three. So out there it's Hens Lundell and I think Bear or something. Five on three for thirty seven seconds. Here's Crude. Shot turn his eye on Bishop. He's been Sharp passed out to Lindell, and he clears it down the ice. They probably have one more rush. There's 10 seconds to go. Goalie is not going to have to play it. And there's Crew got bumped. And now there's five seconds to play it. And they did a buzzer beater. I doubt it. Who knows, though? Here's Bo, that slapper. Stick broke. And that's the end of the period. Chaos, period. A lot of penalties in us are like five, what, the seven minutes of the period. But we'll still leave four nothing after 40 minutes here in game four. So we're actually in 2119. Uh, we have 31 penalty minutes at 14. They're 0 for 3 on the power play. We're 0 for 1. As uh, yeah, I mean, we had one goal score in the center period with that showing on the goal at Ethan Bear. That was during what the four on three. But there was two points where there's it was three on three. Second time was only for five seconds. But you never see that in real life except for overtime usually. I don't know if it's possible. I just if there's two penalties for both sides. But you really don't see that in real life. But Except for overtime, but here you did for what two times, but the second time was only for second time was only for like five seconds. And now it's in the third period. Blues are on the power play, five on three for like twenty more seconds or something like that. I have no idea, but I know we're up four nothing, and we're twenty minutes away from moving on to the West Final, the Western Conference Final. So out there is Fatsa, because obviously we only have three guys. We have Fatsa, Fatsa, Johns, and whoever number five is. Uh, we do not have Alexi yet because okay, he covered that. Because he got injured in game one of the first round. So, yeah. 
etc. So we have Raddit Fatsa, Andre etc. and Steven Johns. Now so they have five guys to lose a face off. Here's Fault. I don't know, Bumpman, I don't know if two dies bad. Five cents down here on the spine on three power play. And here we go, here's Perron. Good save by Bishop. Passes out to Johns, who was like a foot in front of him. Lost the foot. Here's O'Reilly, missed the net. Now they have a final four power play for a minute and 20 seconds. And he got knocked down from behind by me. And sent down on the ice. Wouldn't be ice even if, uh, even if it wasn't on goal. There ha that's, that has to be interference. Here's Trude. Minute they know on the power play. There's someone score. Here's Perron. And he, they still haven't scored as he got knocked down from behind. Cedra turned it over. Sunquist got taken down. No penalty. Hands. And here we go. Behind the net. They still have to put the bank pass back to fault. And here we go. Here's Perron. Crude. Good save. A guy had to jump out of the way of that. Cedra. What did the pass from Bishop? Sends it down the ice. 40 seconds to go on this power play. We're a minute into the period. Come on. Went down there and got the putt. But it sent the. Uh, Infinity and Beyond, and now we only have two dice back because I believe the two dice got hit. Turned aside by the goalie, Bishop. Sent down by Bear. He got hit hard. Here's Tomano, or excuse me, uh, Como, and it's save. Shot in the corner, turned aside. And uh, my guy just missed the depot. And uh, power almost over, and then we'll be back to full strength for the first time in, like, forever. Here we go. Turned around, not hit hard. And finally, this penalty chaos. It's over. Now it's finally back to 5-5 five and, five and the clock's actually moving like it was for, like it normally would be. What a hit! What another hit! And now, no, I do not want to fight it in. It'll be between Fault and Tomo. No. Did he injure my... What is happening? Like, actually. 17-17 to down here in the third. It's still 4 up in Dallas. There's a penalty, so that's nice. So... Let's say penalty, so one on each side. Let's say it's Ruffin on Satan and whoever the other guy was. So it's four on four now. So so it's literally the penalty chaos only stopped for, what, like one minute? So four on four now. And we lose the face off. Oh, I thought it was going to trip him there. Here we go. Now it's not moving like it does in real life, like normal speed. So it's, that's why it's continuing forever. Shot blotted away by Bishop. He's been perfect. Here tonight, open and Shinsa. Should not have done that because there's ice and even full on four. Because there's ice in full strength, and that is an ice. I didn't mean to forgot. Yeah, even like 5 on 5, when it's even strength, which here I know it's not 5 on 5, but it's 4 on 4, there's still ice in. There's, no, there's not ice in when you're on the penalty, though, but there is when it's even strength, even 4 on 4, and when you're on the power play. I did not mean to do that. I beat this ice in. No, I did not. I missed the pass. Another ice in. 16.48 to go in the period. Minute 31 to go here on this 4 on 4. We don't, we don't have Ben because he was had a two-minute minor for board, and then he fought Braden Shen, and then and then he had a five-minute major fight for fighting Braden Shen, and then he got a game misconduct. Here we go. Here we go. Shot missed the net by a mile. Here we go. Here's uh, Taliano. I'm just dumping it in here. Here we go. Dumping Chase here, and Hens got it. Oh, wrap around up. Depot by the goalie. Blues are still down 4 and remember this. There's Haston in. There's Haston is back the other way. Across the Colliano did save by the uh, bad of goalie. He doesn't have a goal yet. 15-59 they know in the period of what? 40 seconds and only on this 4 on 4. 42 seconds. And we win the draw. Shot by Johns is in the maze of people and blocked. Here we know. Blues led in the... He's down on the board. Here's Perron. Not tainted now. No penalty. No center. On a breakaway. And he got a shot on goal, but stopped by the goalie. And that now block. John missed the net. Here we go. Here we are. Stirring on off. That's the butt below the goal line. Across to the slot. And Dennison was tied up. And that's a penalty. That was my bad. And so now the 4 on 4 is over. It's a delayed penalty that. Their goalie should be doing on the bench. It, he is. So sits on five. Soon be be five on four. And clearly the, I, that was my bad. So it's tripping on Dickinson or someone. And now out there is Como, Fossa, Lindell, and someone else. So they're 0 for 5 with 14 shots in the power play. So they have 14 shots but no goals. And they're 0 for 5. There's Stanford after the turnover to say Bishop will hold this one. It's been hitting forever just because of how many penalties there is. 
Still 4 nothing now. Remember, that 0 for 5, like I said, with 14 shots now, probably like 15. Sent down on the ice by Pavelski. Almost got that himself. Here's Tarasino tied up by Pavelski. And had a bump to die. There's so many penalty minutes in this game. Here's Bo's acting. The Blues finally will get the deuce out of the scoreboard and actually score on the power play. Haven't yet. Here's Thomas onside play. Poe at the line walked it out. No, but Tarasino got what? And Pavelski has it made to the tape in that, but he does clear it. Pavelski might get there. And he does. It was just as a... I don't want to do it. Play that! Do the slot. No. Here we go. And uh, here's uh, Bozat the other way. Do the slot. Thomas! Not uh, smashed. And uh, now it's staying in. Here's Sunquist. Shot. Turn to sign and just missed the net. Just missed the net. Now up ahead to Fonson. And he clears that. My word. What is happening? Second row did the this now. It's killed. This is like the game of the year. Just how many hits and penalties there is. And how Ben died. And there's been two fights. And well, Ben not a game is kind of after he fought and lost to Shen. Did save by the goalie. Because he had a two minute mind for board. And then a five minute major for fighting. And then, and then obviously, and then he died. Game is kind of. So there he died. Well, I'm not. It's so many penalties. 25 minutes are on their power play, which is, I believe, like the sixth of the game. And they still have been scoring. They have a boatload of shots. Total on the power play. Good post. And it's sent down the ice. Here we go. Radjohn's first to get in. And goes off the goal stick to the goalie. And he covers with 10 seconds to go on the power play. There's still 12.58 to go in the game. And we win the face off. John's not hit hard. Oh, not hit hard, but he got hit. And here we go. And the power play is finally over. Still 4 nothing. And here's O'Reilly. Lost the putt. That was in the far boards. Tomo. Dickinson. Was dump it down. Once he hit the red line. And I did not mean to run in the goalie. I wasn't paying attention. Here we go. That missed everyone. And there's another penalty. So they're going the power play. What is happening? It's not slashing. And they're on the power play again. And that is Pavelski. That wasn't me. Slapped him right there. Not slapped him, but slashed him. But my word, what is happening? They're 0 for 6 with 17 shots in the summon store. There's a slapper! 18 shots on the power play total, and they're 7th power play in the summon store. Bishop's been outstanding. 11 minutes to go in the game, but far from over because there's so many penalties, although it's 4 nothing. And we win the face off. Here's Lindell. Clears it down the ice to the other blue line. He will not play it. It was literally right in front of me. Sent it to the behind in the net. And that was to the wrong team. And the goalie made the save. Now passes it actually to the right team. Here we go. And here we go. He didn't miss any of the shots. Fire while I was hit hard. Now it's behind the net. And we have the putt. Dickinson will not clear it. Here's Bozat. Just got killed, and this one will go down, down all the way to the ice, and almost sit in there, it's 15, I almost poached at that putt, poached that one, there's Como, we haven't stored him forever, but the Blues haven't stored yet in this game, here's Bear, who stored that short go on the breakaway, which is the start's fourth goal, back in the second, which felt like an eternity ago, what a hit, a lot of hits, penalties, and fights, another big hit, what is happening, a lot of a lot of penalties, a lot of power plays, a lot of fights, and a lot of hitting. A lot of everything, really. A lot of storm for one team. Four up and down, still cleared down the ice. There's still 45 seconds to go on this power play for St. Louis. And Steen, I just missed him. Here we go. Here's Thomas. A cross shot. And the Blues still not cannot store on the power play or in general, really. Did save, or did face off, went up ahead. Here's Como, he might have a break here. He's a Satan, and Satan did not do it cleanly. Sean just missed the net, might have knit the goalie's glove. What a hit, Satan. My goodness, you might have a thousand bruises on your body after this game. Not literally a thousand, but you might have a lot. Or, here we go to Pote. Here's Como, 
Power play is running down. Picked up by Satan. Power play is now over. And finally, they're nine minutes out of this period. We're still nine minutes away from advancing. And the Blues are, what, 0 for 7 with, like, 20 shots in the power play? I mean, it's absurd. And here we go. And I hit hard as Dury on off who lost the putt. Remember, we all have our captain because he had a Damon's time that earlier. And the Damon, the center period, just picked, up, picked off by Johns. Here's Satan, who just dumping in once he hits the red line. Because I, here we go. Hints will not get that putt. There's Stan, or Stan, I, oh, darn it, I should stop doing it, 6.30 to know in the day, it's still four enough in Dallas, this is just absurdly absurd. I'm not sure what the shots are either, they're 0 for 7 with 20 shots on the power play. So that's at least 20 shots in the game for St. Louis, they probably might have like 35, 40 in this game. They're still down four enough, and what a hit! The line by Bear, and then who? And then Bear not hit the Mars, but then sent down the ice, and get in there. First is Spasta, and he scores. I'm not sure if that was Spasta, rather. I don't know why I said Spasta. I'm not sure who that was. That was Spasta. Okay, I thought that was Spasta. It was showing the goal for Dallas. Five nothing Dallas. Sending goal tonight for Brad Spasta. I have no idea what's happening. Just a by Lindell and Bear. This is just chaos. Here's John. Let's clear it down. So amount of penalties. We probably have 40 penalty minutes by now. They have still have 14, but they've had a lot of power plays. 0 for 7. It's their 8 shot. Still turn aside on point blank range. Turn aside. Here's Pavelski. Send it down the ice. Sends it down the ice. And Pavelski did it there first. And it went between. It went Terraceno and Pavelski both missed the putt, and eventually Terraceno got that, and that's another penalty. Why am I doing I'm an idiot. So now we're not, not, yeah, I just don't, I, this is not a long video just because of the amount of penalties in this game. Now that the third one against me, here we go, five on three years fault, and the Blues actually score? I have no idea. Tipped out of there, fainted boards, cleared, well, it's cleared out of the zone, and Pareto was offside. Fox is one away from the hat trade. That does not look like anything like right at Fox. So. Man, didn't send Lindell and Bear out there. Hits 29-17 favor of us. Not sure what the shots are. And that is blocked. Turned over. Here, here's Shin. Poached at the way by Bishop. Here's uh, here's Bear. Here was just like a two-on-one. Didn't send up. Denied. Stone cold. Here we go. Here's O'Reilly. Here's Perron. And Perron, another save by the goalie. Goes behind the net. Here we go. Here's O'Reilly. A cushion stopped. Bear has it. And the, and the frustration for the St. Louis continues. Center on the boards by their goalie. The pass picked up by Shen. Here's O'Reilly. Up it. Perron. And he got hit caught from behind. And stayed in the zone. Fault did keep. Pareto blocked. Another shot stopped by Bishop. And this one will go down on the ice. Five seconds to know here on this five on three. And now it'll be five on four for 50 seconds. 425, they don't in the game. And bumped off the putt. Hence, we'll clear it down the ice. And he will play it in now. So he played that one time in the Forbidden Zone. Left it there for Pareto. They're 0 for what? Eight on the power play now with like probably like 25 shots. Here we go. Here's Shen Bendit for him. Stop by Bishop. And cleared it in. Bishop's been outstanding for, what, 56 minutes. We still have four minutes to go. It's still 20 seconds to go on this power play, which is, the, I believe, the Blues' ninth of the game, and they're 0 for 9. Or almost 0 for 9. Here, what a hit! And they're only 0 for 9 because they're not really scoring. That's 8 seconds. And 15 is on That's Como. Did it down there easily. It's saved by the goalie. And they're 0 for 9 on the power. That's like the Texas Stars in the Texas Stars season opener. They went 0 for 7. Blues are 0 for 9. Here we go. Now, but there's been two shorties in this game. I think, right? Two? Here we, uh, three, maybe. I think there's been three shots turned aside by Bishop. And here's set, uh, set to two minutes to know in this game. This is just chaos at this point. And uh, here we go. Down low. Here's Hintz. And that was a weird shot right there. Here we go, and uh, that's the point. Here's Hastin and shot score. Hastin in. With a minute two remaining, sits up in Dallas.
And then the John Klimberg will just uh, dump it down, hit the back of the net. Pavelski will actually get that, or at least he tips it out of there. Here's Hintz, under a minute to play. Here's Nurianov, back in by Hintz, stopped, and oh, almost went in. Stopped by the door, 45.5 the Dell. And we lose the faceoff. They did assist along with Nurianov on that goal by Hastinen. Here we are, it's onside. So we'll be moving on in 35 seconds to the West, Western Conference final shot. Blot, but, and that stopped again by the goal. Here's Radulov. You know, just dump it down. Goal will actually miss it. And it's Hintz. Here we are, here's Bayer at the point. Tip score. What a deflection. Uh, I believe Satan. 7 0 in Dallas. I almost tried saying 11 goal of the playoffs for Satan, and this is the eighth game. What a deflection on the shot by Ethan Bear. 19.5 to go. Assisted by Bear and Hintz, and Bear will cl uh, clear it. And Hintz has it behind the net. Shot by Radjoff. Stop. Pote the way. 10 seconds to go as the Stars are on their way to the Western Conference Final. What a hit at the end. And shot turns side of Bishop, and that's it. The Stars are going to the West Final. Let's go. Wait, now how is Ben back? It just showed Ben right there. No. Why is Ben... See, that's Ben right there. So the captains are first straight hands, which I believe their captain is actually Swartz, not O'Reilly. Ben can't be there because he's ejected. But obviously, that's a butt in the game. But I don't know if he wanted to be there because he was ejected. That game is kind of... But what a day. That was incredible. 41 penalty minutes. <sighs> 41 for us. 16 for them. We went 0 for 1 on the power play. I went 0 for 9. And they had 12 and a half, 12 minutes and 33 seconds of power play time. We had 29 seconds. We had 29 seconds. They had 12 and a half minutes. And we had two, two short of the goals. Time of attack, that we had about 20 seconds more. Passing, they were much better. Shots, 39-38 in favor of us. Hits, 35-17 in favor of us. And faceoffs, 28-18 in favor of us. As we scored three goals in the first period, one goal in the second period, and three goals in the third period. Which is what a game. Which is what a game. And usually I would show you at this time uh, who uh, I would send to see who would be playing in the next round, which in this case will be the Western Diamond Final. But I'm not going to do it in this episode just because how long the game took. Because it, it shouldn't have shouldn't been that long, but because there was, well, a total of, what, 51, 57 penalty minutes. That's the reason why this game took forever. So that's why I'm not going to show you who we're playing in the Western Diamond Final. You said the way in the last episode, which should be... I'm not saying it should be, it's going to be like 10 months or months from now, because obviously if I did NHL 22 for Christmas, I do want to finish the series. But it could be somewhere where, and I also think Stephen Braid's coming up. So I would say the next episode will be, yeah, next episode of a series, it's definitely a promise. Will be, uh, well, the latest it will be is, or I will definitely film next episode of a series. Well, the latest I will film next episode of a series will be, uh, well, during Thanksgiving break, which is the week of Thanksgiving. So. It could be before that, but the latest next episode will be will be during Thanksgiving break, so which is the week of Thanksgiving, which I do get the entire week off. And it could be before that, but it won't, but the latest it will be is the my, is Thanksgiving break, which is the week of Thanksgiving. It'll be before that or during Thanksgiving break, but it won't be after that. Um, so yeah, so yeah, it will. The next episode of the series will be. Well, it will be the latest it will go up will be uh, during Thanksgiving break. It could go up before Thanksgiving break or during Thanksgiving break, but it will go up by Thanksgiving break. So that will be the latest. The next episode of the series will go up as we will be playing. Oh, obviously you guys will find out who be, who who will be we will be playing in the Western Conference Final in the next episode. Stay tuned for that, and make sure to hit the subscribe button and obviously hit the notification bell so you know if I ever have a new video. And if you have any okay, thoughts on the board, hit subscribe the like button. Subscribe if you want to tell your mom, dad, and join your fans. I don't spend about the videos. And I'm going to see you in episode number 11 of his Dallas Stars NHL 21 franchise series. See you in episode number 11. And eat a lot of bacon and go Stars.